Good evening, everybody. Here's a live look at some numbers outside. Temperatures, eh, it's still cold out there. It's 30 degrees in Tarot, 29 in Paris. You saw before the commercial break, the average daytime high is 50. We haven't seen that in a while, but the good news is we get there by this weekend. It looks like we're going to stay there. We get up a little bit warmer than what we've been dealing with, and it looks like we really do stay there. 29 in Casey right now, 30 in Terre Haute, but with the wind, man, that wind out of the north again just kind of cuts through you. You feel it. 23 is what it feels like in Paris, 21 in Terre Haute, 19 over in Mattoon. It's still going to be cold in the morning. We do get into some sunshine tomorrow, but it stays colder than average. Clouds are still pretty active and thick right now. And by active, I mean a little bit of some light snow to the north. We do not see any of that. We may get a few snow flurries outside. We had a little bit of that earlier on in this evening, but as far as anything accumulating, not going to be a problem. What we're looking for again is these clouds to break up and get into some sunshine tomorrow. So let's see what happens with future cast. It is again slow to break them up, but it does keep some of these clouds around and temperatures mid 20s as we talk. But let's talk more specifics quickly about these uh, temperatures outside. Tonight we're going to drop down to 24. 25 in Robinson, 26 in Lagodi. So mid 20s tonight, outer lying areas, 21s and 2s. Wind chills in the teens, so by all means wrap up as you head out and about tomorrow. But when do the clouds move out of here? It's going to be during the day tomorrow. Clouds are going to start to erode and be a little bit more prominent out east. Therefore, the sunshine tries to move back in. Not looking for clear skies tomorrow, but we are going to see some sunshine and don't look for any heat. Even though if, even if we had sunshine or full sunshine, it's just not going to heat up because the winds are still out of the north. It's going to take it until the weekend before we do heat up. We do get above freezing, though, so things become slushy again tomorrow. Uh, again, going to refreeze tomorrow night, and that's what's happening right now. Anything that was wet today, refreezing, and therefore giving us some new slick spots as a result. And as you can see here, Friday morning back down in the lower 20s, but we do get more sunshine Friday. Just don't believe that that's going to lead to a lot of heat yet. It's a slow process. We just wait until Saturday and Sunday to warm up. There's a look at your Friday afternoon upper 40s. Okay, I'll give you that. That's not bad. Still below average. A lot warmer than today, a lot warmer than yesterday. And that's a Friday. So we'll take it there with a lot of sunshine. I'm looking forward to it myself. 24 degrees tonight. Most of the cloudy, it stays cold. Wind chills again in the upper teens. 39 tomorrow, a cold north wind. Partly cloudy is what we'll call it. More clouds in the morning than what we'll have in the afternoon. And I look at tomorrow night back down to 22. So as the sky is clear, the temperatures will get a little bit colder down into the 20s. But the seven day forecast, that's not bad. Saturday looking great at 56. Chance for rain on Sunday. Looks to hang around until Monday. Briefly cooler on Tuesday, but not colder. We're going to reserve the word cold for the 30s, which is what we're doing today and again tomorrow. But 46 next Tuesday, 50 next Wednesday, and those temperatures are around average. One quick look at those temperatures when they're up. You might ask the question, do we have a chance for thunderstorms? Right now it looks to just be a rain event minus the thunderstorms for both Saturday and Sunday.